All right, so as we go on to the second slide here, as you can see right up here to the top of the screen, I guess right up here to the top of the screen, um, you can see what our learning target is. And our learning target today is to provide examples of ethnocentrism and explain how ethnocentrism affects relationships among the people of Asia. In order to be successful, you will have to provide examples of ethnocentrism explain how ethnocentrism affects relationships among the people of Asia, and cite evidence from the texts. Now, as we go through here, we have two slides with teaching points to help guide you. Then we will start with resource slides. Now, on the resource slides, when you get done with the resource, there will be a question at the end of the slides. That's where you can put your answer. Don't be afraid. Each one of you has your own copy of this slideshow. Put your answers on the Google Slides. In the event that you cannot do so and get it to Mr. Curry, you are able to take a piece of paper, write your answers down, take a picture of your answers, email, or text them to Mr. Curry. You may also write on the slides and simply push the turn it in button in Google Classroom. Now, once you get done with the sources, there will be a slide for your writing prompt. If you need to add a slide in order to get your full answer for me, that's quite all right. Go ahead and do so. Then as you get down to the end of this virtual lesson, I have put contact information, my email address, and my cell number. If you have any questions, any, please feel free to text or call me or email me, and I will get back to you and try and answer the question to the best of my abilities. So let's move on.